A cantaloupe is named after a wolf. Yeah, in a consumerist world, everything becomes a commodity alienated from its origins. Over time, cantaloupe just becomes this meaningless symbol for this juicy orange product. And it's totally divorced from the history of how a village in Italy cultivated these melons. The village of Canta Lupo, whose name means Song of the Wolf. A nod to the frequent howling in the Apennine Mountains. But these days, cantaloupe is just like a name on a grocery bin next to a price tag. And a big message of this channel is that the commodification of everything can be resisted through curiosity. Or as Herbert Marcuse said, Remembrance of the past may give rise to dangerous insights, and the established society seems to be apprehensive of the subversive contents of memory. Now, I'm not sure that we can save the world by thinking about melons, but I think it's that same practice of peeling back those layers of mindless, numbing slog.